Oscar Wilde was the first famous case of a person being charged with illegal sex acts of homosexuality in the United Kingdom. Oscar Wilde gave us many books and novels and poems that we read today, such as The Picture of Dorian Gray and The Importance of Being Earnest. Despite that, he was treated very badly during his time, even though his books and novels were wildly popular then as well. Wilde was the type of person to never censor himself and always make his presence known. In his lifetime, he wrote 14 novels, nine plays, and countless poems. He really did care about the work that he was doing and the things that he was writing. Wilde had many accomplishments, both in his writing and his personal life. He was well known at the time and admired, though he did cause controversy with some of his works and the content of them. His writings were often critical of society and included homosexual undertones, which in itself is an accomplishment just because he was able to do it and get away with it. For Wilde, money was no object for most of his life. He lived a luxurious lifestyle and he was happy with that. He grew up in a private school with a mother who was a writer as well of poems and a father who was a surgeon. Despite this, he did struggle personally. He had personal demons such as living in a time when being who he wanted really wasn't a possibility for him, as well as getting his children taken away for that very same reason, and the continuous heartbreak with his lover, Alfred Douglas. Because of his struggles and how he got through them, even if it wasn't his choice, I admire him. He inspired me that I can write whatever I want, and one way or another, someone out there will want to read it, and it will get read, even if the content isn't exactly what a lot of people would find suitable or want. Wilde has taught me that being myself is the most important thing I can do, that just because someone may not like who I am, that I should never ever change who I am. The fact is that he has done this for many people, both in their personal lives and their writing. His writing is amazing and genuine, and has helped many people besides me find their voice and become writers as well. I feel as though being exposed to his works and his person has led me to become the person I am today, unapologetic to the world about who I am, and no longer as shy and hiding as I used to be. In conclusion, Oscar Wilde has his faults. He wasn't always the best person, and he was quite narcissistic. He had his troubles, but he inspires many with his tales and his strength throughout the time when a lot of people weren't able to do what he did. He showed a lot of strength in the time of adversity. He is the person that I think of when I think of who has shaped me into being a person that I am today of confidence and love and love for myself and the others around me deeply. Oscar Wilde is often misquoted as saying, saying, be yourself, everyone else is taken. But something Oscar Wilde did actually say was, I have nothing to declare except my genius, which is not only true for him, but it's a confidence that everyone should strive for.